Hey, what's happening guys? Today we're going to put together a cool little project using uh, Raspberry Pi 3. This will work with any version of Raspberry Pi. And an old um, webcam. That's a Logitech. I think it's a C25. But it should work with any major uh, brand of webcam. And we're going to use a uh, Linux distribution called Motioneye OS. <clears throat> to create a streaming webcam that you can use for home or business security or, you know, for whatever the hell you want. So uh, let's take a look at how to put this together. All right, our first step is to come and get the uh, distribution here, HTTPS colon slash slash github.com slash CC R I S A N slash motion I O S, which will bring you to this main page right here. And if we click on the README file, it will bring us a little bit of information here, including the supported devices. So we can see what boards it's available for the Banana Pi. Odroid C1, C2, XU4, the Pine, A64, and the Raspberry Pis. Sadly, no Orange Pi here. That's too bad. Then we have the installation instructions, which are pretty much standard. You know, download the distribution, extract the archive, Format your SD card with SD formatter and then write the image using either Win32 disc, Win disc Imager or Etcher. Put the card in and boot up. So that's what we're going to do next. All right, let's put everything together. You're going to need to use an Ethernet cable for the initial startup. You can change it to Wi Fi afterwards. Then we're going to need our USB adapter for our keyboard and mouse, our webcam, and finally we need the SD card that has the software in it. What did I do with that? Hold on one second. All right, I found it. So that should take care of all of our connections. And next up, we power it up. And it says it should take a couple of minutes for everything to get ready. So we will check back in in just a couple of minutes. All right, a couple of minutes have passed. Let's bring up a new window and put in our address and oh helps if I put in the right address now it says to come up here and click switch user type in admin with no password and that should bring us in to be able to change our settings so here we have all of our settings and the uh, well the first one I want to change is to uh, be able to use the Wi-Fi with this so I can put it wherever I want. So let me see if we can find that and I'll be right back. All right, to get to that, I turned on the advanced settings up here. And we'll go down here to network, wireless network, turn it on. 
Okay, I guess I have to type in my wireless network name as well as the key. All right, hang on and we'll do that. All right, I changed my settings to Wi-Fi. I increased the uh, number of frames per second. So let's uh, see if we can get back in here. Connecting. And we're rebooted. And hey, look at that. Pretty much a live image. All right, so next thing is I'm going to place this camera where I want it and then we'll try and use it with the um, non-admin access so that we can just throw an address out there so anybody can watch the camera. All right, guys, there you go. Viewing this on my phone here. As you can see from the uh, counter, we'll go up here. That is a live look out my front window this morning. And now I'm afraid I have to go to work. But I hope you guys enjoyed this. If you did, give me a thumbs up. Feel free to comment, share, and don't forget to subscribe. Looks like it's going to be a nice day. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.